Good morning, y'all. Well, it is the end of August, and I'm getting real good about not posting anything. Um, we're just really adjusting to retirement life. I'm used to doing this whole gig by myself, and now all of a sudden I have somebody here with me all the time. And so we're trying to sync our schedules because I'm a morning person, and he's an evening person. And so we're just trying to work it all out, and uh, it's working out fine. We've been on two trips, so we went to Galveston at the beginning of the month, and then last weekend we went to float the river, um, the Guadalupe River, and that was so much fun. We went with some friends we hadn't been with in a long time, and so uh, we had a blast, and I'll show you some footage of that. And other news, it's just freaking hot. It's just hot. 109 has been our high. That was yesterday. So I've been just doing stuff in the house, cleaning out refrigerators, which was so nice because I got it done and it was cold. <laughs> Freezers. And um, so, you know, that's just about it. Nothing big to show. Um, I just wanted to touch base with you. We're going to be having a grocery haul coming up. I got my fridges all cleaned out. And so um, just stick with me. I'll get better at it. I'm just working through it. Oh, not to mention all my technical difficulties. So I'm trying to get all of that lined out too. And um, y'all just stick with me and we'll see you in the next one. Yesterday I was gone, so I didn't see this high, but it got to 111 yesterday. Man, it's hot in Texas. I don't know what we're going to do. We ain't had rain in forever. Bring on some fall temps and some rain, please. Okay, y'all, it's been a while. So here it is. I have cleaned out my fridge. Everything's nice and organized. Everything's been wiped down. But the fridge is bare. There's like hardly any cheese, hardly any veggies, no sandwich meat, very little bacon, very little butter, no yogurts. So we are down to the nitty gritty. So you know what that means? Time for a grocery haul. So I'm going to show you. I didn't get a before on that, but I'm going to get a before on this. Look at that jumbled up mess of a freezer. So I'm going to clean this out and get this ready for my next grocery haul. Okay, we're making progress. Looking a little better already. See, so doing that, I can't figure out why my drawer won't open good. But look, ick, how in the world does all of that get in the bottom of a freezer? Eesh. All right, so I have it all wiped down. And now I have to fit all of this back in there. All right, so it's looking better. I kind of got it organized by dinner foods breakfast foods. So, this is mostly all stuff my little grandkids eat. Occasionally we'll have some of this, mostly just the little Chick-fil-A-like nuggets. 
but this is stuff that they can easily look at and say, hey, I want that. So there is that freezer's organization. Now I have my big freezer. So this freezer is in my laundry room. This came out of the little freezer in the kitchen. I gotta find a place for it, but look. Ugh. Yeah, total disorganization. So, I'm gonna get to that, and I'm gonna get it cleaned out and ready for a grocery haul. I also have a refrigerator on my back porch that I use for overflow and egg storage. And I would say <laughs> that I have enough eggs for a little bit. But usually my overflow of vegetables go in here and that's all I have. And they may not even be any good. Brussels sprouts, the door needs cleaned out. Ugh. And a cauliflower. That was a rotten pepper I just took out, so I'm gonna have to wash these drawers out. And so, there's that. Plenty of eggs, though. Freezer's all organized. So, there it is. It's so much easier, yeah, it probably takes up a lot more space if you use the bins, but it's so much easier to just pull one out see what you got, you know, and then push it back in there rather than have to dig through a bunch of bags and stuff. So, there we are. Meats on the bottom, veggies and processed foods, and the door. That's what the door looks like. Got some empty spaces. I was able to clean out some stuff. Oh, it's a beautiful thing. We'll see how long it stays that way. Okay, so I got this one done too. Got all the eggs organized. I do date my eggs and I do have a system, really. It's kind of backwards, but only me and probably my oldest son knows because he thinks kind of like I do what my system is. <laughs> so if something ever happens to me, they're just going to be like, what? But they are dated. So anyway, that was kind of morbid, sorry cleaned out all the drawers. If things kind of clean, it is an outdoor fridge, so, you know, it's going to have a little bit of dirt and stuff in it, but mostly dead bugs from when I leave the door open this long. So, there's that. Smells wonderful out here.